Hello and welcome back to With Sikhya. In the previous video, we had discussed about options Greeks. The link is in the description below. The topic is very vast, so for these videos, we will stick to the very basics. In this video, we will see how the Greeks are used in options trading. We will be using the example of Dabur India Limited as an example to understand this better. So let's begin. Just as a quick refresher, option Greeks are five parameters that measure the sensitivity of an option's price to changes in various underlying factors. The five parameters are delta, gamma, vega, theta, and rho. Options Greeks can be used for a variety of purposes, including uh, they can be used to hedge existing positions or portfolios. For example, if you own a portfolio of stocks, you could buy put options on the same stocks to protect yourself from a decline in the market. Option Greeks can also be used to generate income. For example, you could sell covered calls on stocks that you own. This would involve selling call options with a strike price that is above the current market price of the stock. If the stock price does not rise above the strike price by the expiration date, then you will keep the premium from the call option. Option Greeks can also be used to make directional bets on the stock market. For example, if you believe that the stock market is going to decline, you could buy put options on a broad market index such as Nifty 50. They can also be used to manage risk. For example, if you are buying a call option, you could sell a put option with the same strike price and expiration date. This would reduce your overall risk but it would also reduce your potential profits. Here are some specific examples of how options streaks can be used. Number one, a hedge fund manager might use options streaks to hedge a portfolio of stocks against a decline in the market. Number two, a trader might use options streaks to generate income by selling covered calls on stocks that they own. Number three, a mutual fund manager might use options Greeks to make directional bets on the stock market. Number four, a risk manager at a bank might use options Greeks to manage the risk of a bank's portfolio. Now these are calculated using Black-Scholes formula. The Black-Scholes formula is a mathematical model used to calculate theoretical price of an options contract. It takes into account the following factors. The underlying asset price, the strike price of the option, the time to expiration of the option, the risk-free interest rate, and the volatility of the underlying asset. The actual calculation requires a lot of st statistical expertise, so we will not get into the details. But we will now see how the Greeks affect the entire options trade. Let's, let's take the example of Dabur India Limited. We are going long on a put option with a strike price of Rs. 510 and the expiration date of October 26, 2023. Spot close is Rs. 547.15 as on October 7, 2023. We also know that delta is negative 0.063, theta is negative 0.077, rho negative 0.0194, vega positive 0.159, and gamma a negative of 0.0047. Let's interpret what these numbers mean. The delta of negative 0.063 indicates that the option price will decrease by rupees 0.063 for every rupee 1 increase in the underlying stock price. This is because a put option gives the holder the right to sell the stock at the strike price 
So a higher stock price makes the option less valuable. The theta of negative 0.077 indicates that the option price will decrease by rupees 0.077 for every day that passes, assuming all other factors remain the same. This is because time decay erodes the value of an option as it gets closer to expiration. The row of negative 0.0194 indicates that the option price will decrease by rupees 0.0194 for 1% increase in interest rate. This is because a higher interest rate makes it more expensive to hold on option as the holder could simply invest their money in a risk-free asset and earn a higher return. A vega of 0.159 indicates that the option price will increase by rupees 0.159 for every 1% increase in volatility. This is because higher volatility makes the option more valuable as it is more likely that the underlying stock price will reach the strike price by expiration. The gamma of 0.0047 indicates that the delta of the option will increase by 0.0047 for every 1 rupee increase in the underlying stock price. This means that the sensitivity of the option price to changes in the stock price will increase as the stock price gets closer to the strike price. For more information on the Greeks for other strike prices of Tower India Limited, you can refer to the link given in the description below. Overall, the Greeks for this long put option indicate that the option is slightly bearish on the underlying stock price and is sensitive to changes in volatility. The option price is also likely to decrease over time and with rising interest rates. However, the positive gamma indicates that the option price will become more sensitive to changes in the stock price as the stock price gets closer to the strike price. In other words, if you believe that the underlying stock price is likely to fall below Rs. 510 by October 26, 2023, then this long put option could be a profitable trade. However, it is important to note that the option price is also sensitive to changes in volatility and time decay. So this was options creaks in action. I hope the example helped you understand the concept better. The options creaks are a highly statistical subject, but a basic knowledge can also go a long way. I highly recommend watching this video again for more clarity. Feel free to share your thoughts on this topic in the comments below. And if you like the video, do give it a thumbs up and please do subscribe to our channel with Sakya. Thank you for watching and see you in the next one.